Hey guys, what's going on? I'm gonna be doing a small little video on two different fragrances. I already did one video on these fragrances right here, but I saw these two and I thought like I haven't done these two nauticas. I told you before I was gonna do, but I don't wanna buy everything. It's not possible. So these two from Nautica are actually a lesser uh, known or maybe people did not review as much. So I just wanna do quickly, okay? So I hope you appreciate it because they're gonna be closing soon. I'm at Star World. This is called Nautica Classic, the first one. Uh, this one, I saw it before, I wanted to buy it, but I did not because there is an issue with the performance with these both, right? This line basically doesn't last, but I like the way the juice color is presentation, the way they smell. You can understand these are for freshy, you know, like summer and mostly for fresh uh, lovers, okay, fresh fragrance lovers. So this one has this in uh, beautiful, interesting juice color, co kind of like green, and it's made to look like a sail. And these are not very expensive, this is Nautica on the bottle. And I think it's a bit different than this one. This one is blue, this is green. So the classic one, I think it smells very nice. It smells uh, like a fresh, citrusy, lemon, floral, and marine notes. Okay, so this is a kind of mix. If you know fragrances like CK1, CK Escape, this one has similar vibes. But I think this fragrance lasts like not so much, like after two hours completely gone. That's the only downside. But you get 100 ml standard and the price is very reasonable. So you can wear this for summer on casual basis. It's a good fragrance if you, I think in TJ Maxx, Ross, Marshall States, you can get this for eight to $10, okay? So very good bargain if you can get this for that price. So next one I'm gonna show you is called Nautica's Blue Ambition, okay? I reviewed this in one of the videos, I remember when, but I'm just gonna do it again. So this one is the new one, okay? So the bottle looks the same, almost the same. The caps are chromish, but it's on plasticky side. So this one, the juice color is blue, okay, blue. Blue means it's kind of like aquatic marine sort of a bottle. It looks like Nautica Voyage kind of a presentation, but this smells really pleasant. This one, I think it's very similar to Dior Sauvage, uh, Dylan Blue, but it's not exactly clone of anything. Even remind me of Bleu de Chanel. Okay, but mostly on the same side as Dior Sauvage, okay? So if you like Dior Sauvage, you can give it a try. It, it lasts a little bit longer than this, maybe two and a half hours compared to one and a half hour of that. And this price is a little bit higher. I think this is a bit more expensive than the other one. I think they're selling this for, yeah, $3.35. So you can try other shops, but no need to buy from here itself. But this fragrance is kind of nice and modern, and I think you can use it for day-to-day -day basis. So these are the two I want to review. Hopefully you like it. Uh, Nautica's classic and nautica's blue ambition check them out and i think i'm gonna sign out have some tea and go back have a nice day i'll see you soon bye bye